You'll usually come into hospital on the day of your procedure, and depending on the theatre list, your arrival time may be a few hours before your operation. Some medical conditions may require you to visit before the day of the procedure for tests or observations, but your letter of admission will clearly state what time you're to come in and where you're to go to. You'll meet the various members of the surgical team before you go down to theatre. They'll ask you a number of questions to make sure that all the information is correct and go through your notes to see that nothing has been missed before asking you to confirm your consent to surgery. There may be some time between seeing each member of the team and you can relax with a book or a newspaper. A nurse will put on your hospital identification wristbands, check that all your personal details are correct and do a final health check, taking your blood pressure, pulse and temperature. You then change into a theatre gown and you're ready for surgery. All your personal belongings are sealed in a bag which is locked safely away while you're in theatre and is returned to you when you go to the ward. When you arrive in the theatre suite you'll go into the anaesthetic room and while the anaesthetist and nurse prepare you for the operation the surgical team scrub up and the theatre nurse prepares and checks all the equipment which is required for your procedure. There's a final briefing in the theatre which makes sure that everything has been checked and only when this final check has been completed can the operation begin. You're closely monitored by the anaesthetist for the whole time the surgeons are operating. The length of time you're in theatre for will vary depending on your procedure and you'll be given an estimated time for when your friends and family can call to see how you are. When the operation is over, you'll be taken to the recovery area, where you'll stay until you're stable enough to be moved to your ward, the post-anesthetic care unit, or critical care, depending on the procedure you had and your condition following the surgery.